Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin, if you are new here and if you're not, welcome back. Thank you so much for being here today. In today's video, I wanted to share with you this delicious green smoothie that myself and Kevin have been enjoying, I would say, for the last week. Every day, just as it's been super duper hot, I've just been craving something cold and delicious. It's fast. <laughs> It's been a while since I've done a cooking video. The last thing I shared with you was the lemon banana muffins. Chef's kiss, so good. And then prior to that, I think it was the vegan tikka masala. So I'm really excited to be back and sharing with you a smoothie recipe. Just before we get started, we do have both fresh and frozen produce in the smoothie, and then we have two different superfood powders just to enhance the overall nutritional benefit in the green smoothie. If you don't actually have the alkaline greens powder that I'm showing today in the video, know that you can use your favorite greens powder. And then with the protein, I mean, if you don't have this lean protein, Say a vanilla protein in general. The other one that we do have in the cupboard is this Vega protein. This is another vegan protein. However, if I'm being totally honest, this one to me tastes a little more grainy and like a protein powder, unlike the Tropica one, which has a really smooth, awesome flavor. So know that this is another option in terms of vegan protein. From this brand, I so much prefer the salted caramel flavor. Oh my gosh, it's so good for a vanilla flavor. I love the one from Tropica. So just a little side note before we get started, that's enough chatting, let's get right into the smoothie. I'm hungry! I like to do the liquids first. I'm using this coconut water, which is 100% when you check the ingredient list, 100% natural coconut water. So I'll be going in, this is 33.8 fluid ounces. I'm going to fill it with 16. P.S. This recipe is for two servings. Simple math, cut it in half if you're just doing it for yourself. Then go in with your choice of non-dairy milk. I'm using soy milk from Trader Joe's. And I'll go about, say, that was four ounces of non-dairy milk. Fresh or frozen bananas, totally up to you. I have one frozen banana left. And then I'm also going to go in with one fresh banana something else that I've been doing. I'm saving the banana peels. I soak the banana peels in water for two days and then I water my plants with it. Two bananas for two servings. If it's just for you, one banana will do you just fine. Next, an avocado. Avocado, much like the banana, makes it creamy and delicious. Ooh, nice job. Pop your little seed out and scoop the goods into your smoothie. I just love a smoothie because it's so great for getting so much all into one meal. To keep up with our theme of creamy goodness, I'm going in with a teaspoon of hemp seeds, healthy fats, protein, I mean ice because, hello. And I like it really cold, so six ice cubes. Now I've made this smoothie with both kale and spinach. Either are perfect. You can do frozen or fresh. I have yet to try, but I would also be intrigued with a frozen pea option or frozen broccoli to get your serving of greens into your smoothie. I'll be going in with a generous handful. Yes. We fill up quick here, so kind of push down, give yourself the space. Just a little more. Kale, I know it's not everyone's favorite, so popping it in the smoothie is a great way to get it into your diet. Welcome home. All right, you guys, so the powders are last. I'll be using two, this alkaline green and lean protein in vanilla flavor. The alkaline green, I was just reading in this book, Eat Feel Fresh by Sahara Rose about incorporating more alkaline foods into your diet. So I've been pulling this powder back in and eating this every day. Looking on the back, there's a whole bunch of vitamin D, rich in chlorophyll, supports a healthy immune system, healthy bones and teeth, valuable source of phytonutrients and vitamins, contains the full range of essential amino acids. And I know that if you follow a vegan diet, that is super important to get the full range of essential amino acids. So I'll go in with a heaping teaspoon of this. 
and considering it's a greens powder, the taste is actually really good. Last but certainly not least, the vanilla flavor lean protein by Tropica. This I'll do two servings because again, I'm making two servings of the smoothie, so I'll go in with one. It even smells so good. Whoops, two, spill some on the counter. And then just like a half for good luck. And so I'm not wasting. Just slide your mess in there and easy now we blend everything up okay so we're just under 48 ounces in total so while I'm actually making the smoothie, I like to alternate the speeds because I feel like it just makes it smoother and gets out any lingering bits in there. Oh yeah, that's good. And then just for color contrast, looks aesthetic. I like to top it with some goji berries, but also health. And just like that, smoothie's done. So good. There is no denying that it is a green smoothie, but if this makes any sense, it doesn't actually taste like dirt. It doesn't have a really earthy flavor like certain juices or green smoothies can have that undertone. Powder, I love the alkaline greens powder. It's super, super good. Flavor, I love, and the lean protein powder. It makes it really sweet. When I was making this smoothie last week, we did have Medjool dates, but I don't have any left in the fridge. Makes it a little bit sweeter, so if you do have more of a sweet tooth, know that you can throw, say, two dates in there, and that will really sweeten it up, but I've gotten used to it without it, and I really like it, so. Hmm. If you guys enjoyed today's video, then please be sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel. That way you never miss a new video. Be kind to yourself, be kind to others. Thank you so much for being here today. I hope that you enjoy this recipe if you give it a go, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Would you like yours now? Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin, if we... Want some more? Yeah. Good to the very last drop.